guys, I'm Heather from LuLaRoe, Heather Huff, and I am currently in the Q Club. I turn in all my paperwork June 30th. Today is August 6th, so getting closer for sure. Um, so we have started our Lula Room, and we I was looking at YouTube videos trying to get an idea of kind of what we wanted to do, and I was finding that a lot of people would be like, Oh, this is my Lula room. We have a really tiny space, but they would have like an entire room. And we have a three bedroom ranch, no basement. So our Lula room is this. Um, we have to have a bed. My family lives out of town. Um, so when they come, we want them to have a place to stay. So it's not just a day trip. Um, right now, the closet is just full of stuff. And we've got our elliptical in here, obviously, and just other stuff so we've got kind of a long ways to go as you can maybe tell it's really dark in here um, there's one window and one light so we've got our work cut out for us so we wanted to show everybody kind of how we're maximizing our space making it functional for LuLaRoe and functional for people to stay in so I was gonna just kind of share our vision today and check in a couple times um, we're not gonna get it all done today so our next video you'll probably see me in something different um, but basically, we've got really dark blue walls right now, and we need to lighten them up just because of the room. So we're definitely going to be painting. Um, this wall, we're going to have two racks, um, permanent ones that are mounted against the wall. And we're going to have a permanent one mounted here. Um, this one's going to be long for our dresses. I should have Julia's. And this one's going to be short for our shirts and uh, skirts. And then we'll also use the closet space for more dresses, um, for maxis, for Lindsay's. So we should have plenty of room, especially getting started. And we're just going to have kind of tubs for our leggings right now. Um, what we're going to do with the bed, because we can't get rid of it, we can't move it out. Um, we've got no other space for it for when people are here. This is a queen size bed. So we're basically going to make a table uh, to be like a desk. So I'll be able to fold clothes on it. Um, he will not be allowed in here anymore. We don't want cat hair on anything, so he's losing his room. Sorry, buddy. Um, over here is where we're going to have our photography wall. So, and this is our two-year-old. I'm sure she'll be in lots of our videos. Jalen, say hi. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna have our photography wall here. Um, this will also, we're also going to have a rack here and I got one of those hanging features, um, that's typically used for like shoes and towels and stuff and I'm going to put all my shipping stuff there so I'll have my shipping stuff right here in easy reach of the desk. Um, we basically to get started, we set a budget and we had to fit our inventory and all the other stuff, you know, you have to buy for it. Um, so this room isn't necessarily going to be seen by other people. Mm -hmm. So we really kind of maximize our budget here. Um, we just got brackets and PVC pipes for the racks. Um, so that saved a lot of money. Even getting regular racks would have been probably about three times as expensive as the PVC pipe. So we definitely saved money in here, but we're just getting started. We're finding out what works for us, and so we're going to start with that and go up from there if we need to. Did I miss anything? Nope, I don't think so. All right, so next time we check in, we'll probably be painting or have painted and getting ready to mount some stuff. So 